David Gala's brief memorial and burial service. He was born in 1952 and they lost him to a road accident in 7th of June 2022. Family. He was married to the Helen Yevu Bingili in 1970. He was a father to eight children. Their names Damwa Charo, Carissa Charo, Patience Gilmo Charo, Ngala Charo, Charlotte Kahonzi Charo, Pendo Charo, Riziki Charo, and Ngonyo Charo. He was a father in law to three. He was a grandfather to 22 grandchildren. He was also a great grandfather to three great grandchildren. He won a Disney Wildlife Conservation Hero Award for his conservation work to save the Kenyan's Arabuko Sokoke Forest. He also worked for many organizations. He was very knowledgeable in flora and fauna of Arabuko Sokoke Forest. He worked with the University of East Anglia Arabuko Expedition to record and survey endemic birds. He helped many in biodiversity research in the Arabuko Sokoke forest. He was a father, a friend, a mentor, and loved by many. He will always be remembered, always. The memorial service took place at Arabuko Sokoke forest in 16th of June, 2022. We arrived at Komani a place or a spot where David Ngala loved the most inside the Arabuko Sokoke forest. Komani comes from the word Koma. Koma is a piece of wood from the Krewia Flygophila in local name we call it Mukon. In 1993, Willie Ganda and David Ngala himself installed the comas at the Komani site. Mijikenda used to pray to God through spirits of the ancestors. When the elders die, memorial posts are installed in honor of the deceased. We were then divided into different groups to do bad and nature work in memory of David Ngala. From the Asfaga group, Willy Ganda and Kalama Kitsao went on a search for the Sokoke Scopes Owl. On the other side, Samuel Elijah, Johnson Kafulo, Linux Kirao, and others led the groups into the nature works. It was a very educative work, uh, being able to identify uh, most plants in the forest and also uh, the bird calls. Yeah, as the forest is thicket, so it's uh, quite hard to uh, spot the birds, but you can hear them call.
we were led in a trail by Kalama Kitao into the uh, nature trail of the uh, Sinometra ticket uh, to spot the Sokoke scopes owl, yeah, of which uh, they succeeded in spotting them, Mr. Willie and Kalama. So Cockescopes Owl were the favorite birds of David Ngala, uh, which makes it very important that we saw them uh, because he really liked them, so it's one way of honoring him. And also the so Cockescopes Owl are the smallest scopes owl. These owls are insectivorous and uh, we, are, we are very lucky to spot them as they normally change their roosting places most of the time. Finally, Mr. Samuel got a clear photo of the Sokokescope's owl. Tributes from CFA, Arabuko Sokoke Forest Guides Association, Kenya Wildlife Service, Kefri, Arocha Kenya, Necha Kenya, and Friends of Arabuko Sokoke Forest. At the Badok and the tribute session, we went near Mida Primary for candle lighting session. Because you were with him when you were in the forest department, as it has been narrated, he was a tall man. Then he also became the driver. I remember the time we met, he was doing contractual driving. We are going to be near where the accident happened. Sarala was on the highway. Eighteenth June twenty twenty two, us Fagel members arrived early in the morning and they did Badok in honor of David Ngala. Few minutes before he was laid to rest, he got tributes from their family dog. He stayed there for some few minutes before he left.
thanks to all the people who have been there for his family. For sure, David Ngala will always be remembered. Thank you for watching this video. To all the people who have gone through David's hands, don't forget to conserve nature.